All right, Shalom. Shalom, first and foremost, I want to give all glory, honor, and praises to Yahweh, Bashim, Yahweh Shai, Bashim, Chakradash, double honor to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone who rule and teach well. Peace, love, salutation to the elect 144 first fruit. I'm your brother Kasha Kwala from the GMS Atlanta Church. Coming back at you with another um, little quick Hebrew. Uh, this one's going to be fairly quick, a little quicker than the last one. Uh, but we're going to go over something all brothers know. It's uh, Zechariah chapter 14 and 9. And I'm going to read it real quick. This is Zechariah chapter 14, verse 9. And the Lord shall be king over all the earth. And that day shall there be one Lord and his name one. All right. So today we're going to go over Zechariah 14 and 9 in the Hebrew. All right. We're going to go over here. All right. And this is what I have for today. Put it up to the camera so y'all can see it pretty good. And I'm going to do like last time. I'm going to bring it down and um, let y'all pause the video and get this written down. But that's the, the lesson for today. And again, uh, this is Zechariah chapter 14, verse 9. And the Lord shall be king over all the earth. In that day shall there be one Lord and his name one. So without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and bring the camera down. See that pretty good. All right. So we got Zechariah chapter 14 and 9. I know I had like a little precept there, don't mind that. We're going over Zechariah 14 and 9. Again, and the Lord shall be king over all the earth, and that day shall there be one Lord. And his name one. All right. So I'm going to go through this fairly quick because y'all can pause the video and um, get all that you need here. And of course, it's going from uh, right to left. All right. So we're starting off with and shall be. Wa ha ya. Okay. Wa ha ya. Wa ha ya. Wa ha ya. And shall be. All right, y'all can write the uh, paleo because we deal with the ancient paleo Hebrew Lashem Akwadash. Yes, we do study the uh, the Assyrian as well. Uh, the blue letter is pretty much 100% Assyrian. And uh, just for edification purposes, for if someone is not watching this, uh, the Assyrian, the Assyrian Hebrew looks like looks like this right here all right that's what the assyrian characters look like all right all those right there if y'all want to pause the video and get that you can all right we're gonna go back to the lesson at hand all right so again we got and shall be Waha uh, Wahaya. And then the Lord Yahawa. 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 The Lord. And then King. King is Malak. We got La Malak. La Malak. Over all the earth, I'll call Ha Arataza. I'll call Ha Arataza. So I'll call Ha Arataza. I'll call Ha Arataza. Now we're going down to 
in that day. In that day is Ba Ya Wum 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 and that's in that day. And then we got he, ha ha, wa ah, ha ha, wa ah, ha ha wa ah, ha ha wa ah, ha ha wa ah, and that's he. And again, you got the the Lord's name, Yahweh, Yahweh, Yahweh. And then you have the number one. A hud. A hud. A hud. And Lord willing, I'm going to do a lesson on numbers 1 through 10. All right. Because pretty much after you get to 10, uh, you say the number number 10 after each uh, number. So say you go into 11, you will say a hud and then the number 10 after that. I think it's Shanya. If I'm not mistaken, but I'll go, I'll go into that, maybe Lord willing, on the next lesson. All right, in His name. All right, in His name, Wa, Sham Wa. All right, Wa Sham Wa. Wa Sham Wa. Wa Sham Wa. And again. A chud, a chud, which is one. So back up. Wahaya, Yahawa, La Malak, Al Kal Haaratza, Bayawum, Hahawa Ah, Yahawa, A chud, Washamya, Washamwa, Salakia, Washamwa. A hood. And one more time. Wahaya. Yahweh. La Malak. Al Kal Ha Arataza. Bayawum. Hahawa Ah. Yahweh. A hood. Washamwa. A hood. And that is. That is um, Zechariah, which is Zechariah, Yahweh remembers, chapter 14, verse 9. All right. And the Lord shall be king over all the earth in that day. Shall there be one Lord in his name, one. All right. Uh, let me bring the camera back up. Well, willing y'all can see me here. So, Lord willing, that was edifying. All right. First, uh, and lastly, I want to give all glory, honor, and praises to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem, Wachakwadash. Double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone who rule and teach well. Peace, love, salutation to the elect 144 first fruit. I'm a brother Kasha Kuala from the GMS Atlanta Church. And uh, Lord willing, this was edifying. We went over Zechariah 14 and 9 in the Hebrew and also in the, uh, in the Paleo Hebrew. And gave you, you know, broken down and whatnot. Your brothers can pause the video, write it down. And with that, I'm going to say Shalom.